What's up everyone? This is Michael Bidoza, Blading with Chef Knives, and I've been making these amazing meals. I just, it's like blading for me. I get in these creative processes and I sort of just lose the moment. And I'm gonna remember to record it, and I'm, that's what I'm doing today. So most of these dishes are inspired by an old ingredient that is almost like a leftover and I don't want to see it go to waste so I take this ingredient and try to form it in some different way. A barbecue a couple weeks back, the Roller Banger barbecue, and I have, we made banger tacos and so this is part of the coleslaw that is repurposed for, uh, which is going to go really well with some pork. So I'm going to do some pork chops, the apple jicama coleslaw, and we're gonna have some baked potatoes with it because I just haven't had a really solid, good baked potato in a good while. Oil, and coat this with some olive oil. We'll check back in an hour. In the meanwhile, I'm gonna start these pork chops. The one thing I hate about pork chops is when it's tough and you're trying to pull it away. So I went ahead and just added a little bit of liquid. I put the top on and now I'm gonna steam it just to get it a little bit fork tender. Uh, this is a, a specialty banger coleslaw that is served with banger tacos and this is a little bit of leftovers and I'm just gonna go ahead and add that to our pork chops. Ta-da! and the apple from oxidizing, uh, which happens when it turns brown on the edges, I'm adding citrus. And for this citrus, I'm gonna keep it green and I'm doing a lime. Lastly, I'm gonna chop some cilantro. If I was to use a hot pan and just dump this in, it would sear it and it would essentially burn it because bacon just burns fast. So that's why I use a cold pan and we're going to bring this all up to temp. Sour cream is a must have when it comes to baked yes. potatoes. So is cheddar cheese, and so are bacon bits. Remember that liquid I used to steam the pork chops? Yeah. Gravy! See, I thought about one scoop, but... I don't think that was enough. Oh, it's perfect. Super excited to eat this because look at how tender this meat is. I just did that with a fork and a knife and it wasn't like the whole table was shaking. And it's a butter knife. 
butter now. Oh my god. This gravy tastes like it's butter. I would like some of it, please. Some of the hippama. I like butter. Woo! Very much like butter. <laughs> He's crazy. <laughs> Let me try this hickam up. It's good. It's good. It's so good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's blue though. It's so good. <laughs> We're gonna have a conversation consisting of a mmm, mmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'm gonna go eat this, but you don't have to, but if you like it, please hit that little thumbs up in the corner. You don't have to, but if you want to keep, uh, if you, if you want to keep up to date, hit the subscribe button and the uh, notification bell. <laughs> um, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, I'll check back with you with more recipes coming up as soon as I can. Peace.